Good morning, YouTube. Um, this is James with Huber Steam Cleaning. And today we were called out to a, uh, we're gonna call it a red wine stain disaster. Uh, a customer had a bottle of wine and they spilt it on white carpet. We've heard the story many times, um, but we're gonna try to tackle an unusually large stain of red wine. We're trying to save their carpet. So uh, they looked us up and they decided that uh, they were gonna try to save it before they purchased new, very expensive bourbon carpet. And so we're gonna give it a shot. Um, we're gonna uh, use uh, a couple different processes and see what we have. So stay tuned. Uh, and remember, if you like this video, to subscribe, like, and actually follow to get um, um, future videos. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at it. Here we go. All right, guys, here we go. We're gonna go in and uh, take a look at it. It's a house that they're renovating. And they had um, gorgeous bourbon carpet. All right, we're gonna go in. And it's in this room here, beautiful bourbon carpet. And they had a bottle of wine. that they spilt out of the closet when they were emptying the closet out. We're gonna attempt to get this out of here. All right guys, stay tuned. Um, what happened again with the... Okay, he had a bottle of wine up on the shelf with a bunch of other things. I got you. And while he was out of town, the shelf broke and oh. the bottle fell and broke and spewed. Gotcha. So the shelf just like broke. Yes. Just, oh, wow. It's the wired shelf. And yeah. He said it must not have been mounted on the stud. Okay, I got gotcha. you. All right, guys, today we're going to probably try to tackle this thing in a few different ways. Um, first of all, we're going to try a protein spotter. If you remember that uh, any kind of wine or any kind of just organic things are protein. And so um, we actually have different chemicals. Um, the one that we're going to use today is just a protein spotter by Bridgepoint. Um, not to give them a plug or anything like that, but... Uh, it often works on these red stain, one on stains. This has been here probably, I think said a couple of weeks. Mm -hmm. So it's set in for a couple of weeks. We're gonna give it a shot. The best thing about it is that they did not touch it. So we may get better results um, because they didn't do it. All right, let's take a look at it. Here we go. All right, guys, let's try it. Yeah, we got it. We got it.
right, guys. So what we're doing is we're applying the um, chemistry to try to remove it. And as you can see, uh, it's doing an absolutely fantastic job. all right guys it it really appears to be working so um it's just a matter of having the knowledge we're so excited we're about to do it we're gonna check it out stay tuned <laughs> All right, guys, so we're excited because it is actually uh, potentially working. So remember the most important thing when you have a huge spill is to remove the uh, solution out of it. So today we're gonna use our bonzer because it has like five jets on it and the way that they shoot in, it really flushes the carpet. And a lot of times you get people uh, speaking on wicking, which is when the, uh, when the carpet actually pulls things underneath back up through the carpet, the, the fluids. What you wanna do is really flush the carpet. So our best chance is with the bonzer. We're actually gonna flush this carpet to make sure that uh, if this stain fully removes, it will not wick back up. We're gonna get a call back. So we're gonna flush it, flush it, flush it. That's the key to it. All right, stay tuned, we'll check it out. Uh, step two, here we go. All right, here we go. There we go, guys. working its plan. This is working its plan. Don't you love it when the plan comes together? <laughs> oh yeah! Take a look at it. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is what we did to the wand stain. So, really, when you have these, a lot of people try to mess with them. It's more important actually just to call the professionals. Anyway, so we got it. We're going to get the customer's reaction and see what they think about the wand stain. 
Are you kidding me? What do you think? James. Huh? It's a miracle. <laughs> I cannot believe this was dry for three weeks. Oh wow. Really? Yes. Okay, okay. And my son thought it would never come clean. Really? Uh, yeah, he was prepared to replace it. Oh, wow. And I insisted that we at least try before uh -huh. we replace it. Yeah. It's like brand new. This carpet was only three months old. Oh, wow. That was another thing that okay. was so bad to uh -huh. have to replace it again. Yeah. It's perfect. <laughs> and how did you find us again? Well, so I tapped over the deal and he said, I can't do it, but I can tell you exactly who can clean it. Get out of here. That's what he and said. And that was another cleaner, so he's so That fun. was your competitor. Yes, ma'am. He <laughs> said, if if James can't do it, it can't be done. Oh, my God. Yeah. 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 I mean, that, that is pretty cool. Yes, that is so you. cool. Yes, ma'am. I mean, I it is absolutely beautiful. It is a miracle. I kid it, you not. Yes. It is a miracle. Yes. We never thought this would happen. Gotcha. And I can't believe you did it so fast. Yeah, we went slow so we could video and uh, try to have some footage. Because people, like I said, a lot of people don't think that you can get that up. Um, but what you guys, the best thing you guys did was leave it alone. Um, and see, that's not a well-known thing. It's not. Let me give you an example. Let's say, for instance, it's Thanksgiving and you got a white shirt on and you spill some gravy on it. So let's say you push it, put it in the washer, but you still see that stain. But when you put it in that dryer, it's almost impossible to get that stain out you set the stain. And so a lot of people don't know that when you try to clean it, it's still fibers, just like a shirt, you set the stain and it's almost impossible to get it out. The best thing you guys did was leave it alone because our chemistry works. Because it has a chance to work without you, wow. you know what I'm saying, put it in. I mean, and I loved, is it Danielle? Danielle, yeah, yeah, she She's awesome. a dog. <laughs> well, I we just yeah. were instant friends. Oh, God, yeah, she's like that with everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah she's yeah, wonderful. Yeah, she is, yeah. She is a great front person. Yes, ma'am, that's James. awesome. I'll let her know that she's not getting a raise, but I'll let her know. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, well, she needs that. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, we yeah. both have boys. Okay, so okay. Yeah, yeah. You don't, yeah. you don't do remodeling. He's we don't do remodeling. Okay. I decided I'd try. Okay. Oh, thank no, you. Don't do landscaping. No, don't. Do, <laughs> no, I guess it's plumbing or electrical. No, 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 no. We we do what we do, and we leave the rest over to the okay, experts. Yes, well, ma'am. I guess that's how you can do. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you for having us out, um, guys. Once again, this is um, Hubert Steen Cleaning with another uh, great job. Um, remember, if you like if you like this video, subscribe, like, and follow. Thank you so much. We'll see you on the next one.